Janet Jackson's beef with Kamala Harris may date back further than the current presidential campaign. This is due to past comments made by the Democratic nominee regarding Michael Jackson's child molestation trial that have resurfaced. Following Janet's remarks about Kamala, where she mistakenly stated that the vice president's father was white, old footage from 2004 reappeared online. In this video, then San Francisco Deputy City Attorney Harris discusses Michael's upcoming trial. In general, uh, the child will be able to recall and recollect with some detail the incident, and that is persuasive to a jury, even if it is the only testimony that is available. It wasn't so much that Jackson was misinformed, but that she echoed MAGA-fueled lies. Her statement about what she heard sounded eerily similar to former President Donald Trump's lie at the National Association of Black Journalists Convention in July, that the biracial Harris was not black. Do you believe that Vice President Kamala Harris is only on the ticket because she is a black woman? Well, I can say, no, I think it's maybe a little bit different. So, uh, I've known her a long time indirectly, not directly very much, and she was always of Indian heritage, and she was only promoting Indian heritage. I didn't know she was black until a number of years ago when she happened to turn black, and now she wants to be known as black. So I don't know, is she Indian or is she black? She has always but identified you know as a black woman. I respect she went to a historically either black one. college. I respect either one, but she obviously doesn't because she was Indian all the way and then all of a sudden she made a turn and she went, she became a black person. Just to be clear, sir, do and you I believe think, that she is I think she somebody should look into that. Harris has consistently identified as both black and South Asian American, which contradicts Donald Trump's and Janet Jackson's claims. She was born to an Indian mother and a black Jamaican father, both of whom immigrated to the United States. The U.S. Census recognizes people of Jamaican descent as part of the black racial group. According to her White House biography, she is the first woman, the first black American, and the first South Asian American elected as vice president. In a 2016 article, Harris reflected on her mother's influence after her parents' divorce, noting her mother raised her and her sister Maya as black women. My mother was very well aware that she was raising two black girls to be two black women. And she did that instilling in us pride in our culture and cultures, always um, knowing that we would face all kinds of obstacles, but she never let us believe that anything could get in the way.